Now a word from our sponsors. Does this look like you? Fret no longer. We have just what you need. This is a Vetter Holsters Cobra gun belt. With the step-down buckle design, it allows you to easily put it on and take it off without having to thread the giant buckle through your belt loops. It fits. From the moment that we met You're worth the wait Visit betterholsters.com to get yours today. What's going on guys? This is Drop It Like It's Scott and today we are out on the range. We're going to do some shooting. We're going to have a good time today uh, because I've got a really cool gun that I want you guys to check out because I think it's really cool and I've seen some good reviews on it and it's a company that I really like and it is a company called TSOS, and they have just released a new line of pistols that they have, and they've got some new shotguns in, in uh, Tokarov, they got some uh, uh, Spandau arms, they got some shotguns, all through SDS imports, but this, TSOS, <laughs> <laughs> it's it's absolutely cool. I'm sure you've probably seen some videos. Uh, Honest Outlaw has done some videos on this thing. There's been a few other people that have done it on there. Um, but I want to go ahead and show it to you guys so you guys can see what this thing is. This is the TSOS Raider. Check this thing out. T E A U T P. My goodness, this is a fantastic 1911 chambered in 45 ACP, the Lord's caliber. Now this is a friend of mine's gun, so he loaned this to me to be able to do a review on, so thank you very much for allowing me to uh, check out your gun, put some rounds through it, and we're gonna test this thing out. It does have some features on here that are really cool, front and rear serrations. Uh, you got your sights here. And these are adjustable sights. You can adjust them on the on the top here to where you can get lined up just perfectly. <clears throat> it does have an ambi safety right here on the side. Ambi. If you're right-handed or wrong-handed shooters, you have ambi. It does have your mag release is on the left side of the pistol. It's got your safety, uh, your safety grip safety right here. It does have a skeletonized hammer. This has a non-skeletonized trigger, but the trigger is great so let's go and show you the trigger here it is right that's to the wall and that's and now that here's your here's your reset <laughs> this thing is really cool I love the flat dark earth color on here this is really really cool and this is the T sauce Raider and we're gonna go ahead and put some rounds down range through this thing and I've got my target set up down there and let me show you some of the stuff that it comes with inside the case. Of course, it's got its cleaning, your cleaning rods, your cleaning brushes, basic stuff that comes in with your with your uh, new pistols and with your new cases. Look, uh, empty chamber indicator, trigger, trigger guard. It's got your key here to release this to clean your pistol to take it apart. It comes with two two eight round eight round magazines, and these are. Italian magazines. So we're gonna go ahead and load these up. We're gonna take it out to the range. You guys can tell me in the comment section below, what do you think of this? Do you think this is a good gun, a great gun, a phenomenal gun, a spectacular gun, all of the above gun? Let me know in the comment section below. We're gonna get this thing loaded up and we're gonna head over to the range and get some shots. All right, so we're about 10 yards away, but we've got some steel targets over there. We're gonna hit those. We're round chambered and again, you guys tell me what you think about this gun. All right, here we go. Mag one down. Mag two in place. We're clear. Let's reload it. All right, here we go. I like this a lot. One thing that I, I will have to uh, I will have to check on is the magazine 
doesn't quite drop out as easy as I want it to. Possibly because it's a new gun and it needs to be broken in a little bit. But, you know, it's... If you get a good, good grip on it and push it, it'll drop it. But it takes a little bit of pressure to push that thing through. The sights are pretty good. The sights are on. I may need to adjust it a little bit because it's shooting. I have to put the front sight a little bit higher in the back sight in order to hit the steel because it's kind of a little shooting low. So is that me possibly shooting downwards? Maybe. We may have to raise that up just a touch to get it lined up. So here's what I was having to do. I had to take the, the front sight and raise it a little bit higher in the back sight in order to be on target. Let's get a couple more rounds through this thing. 45 is a fun gun to shoot. The recoil, I expected it to be a little heavier. It's actually not bad at all. I mean, it, it pushes for sure because it's a 45 and it's gonna, it's gonna have that little bit more of a kick to it than your standard, you know, nine millimeters and any stuff like that. Because it's 45, it's, it's very manageable. I really like this a lot. And <laughs> the only thing I can say is let's shoot some more. All right, so I'm just going to put some rounds on this thing. And you guys tell me what you think. Again, there's that magazine issue. All right, tell me what you guys think in the comments section below. We're clear, we're empty. What do you guys think of this? This is the T-Sauce Raider. I think it's pretty spectacular. I love this thing. It's, it shoots just fine. And my goodness. So a little bit dirty at the end. Sorry for making your gun dirty, bud. A little bit dirty, so we'll clean it off. Make sure it, it sh sparkles and shines and all that good stuff but yeah this is the t-sauce raider again tell me in the comment section below what do you guys think of this gun i think it's pretty awesome i love it all right thanks for watching drop a like it scott enjoy your day enjoy the journey here's your word of encouragement for today all right this comes out of habakkuk that's a tough one to say three verse two and it says lord i have heard of your fame and i stand in awe of your deeds lord repeat them in our day and in our time make them known in wrath remember mercy hey thanks for watching drop it like it scott i hope you enjoy your day enjoy the journey i appreciate you guys we'll see you on the next one